All right, so currently still in Chicago. We're leaving today, but our flight is pretty late. I think our flight leaves at like 6 p.m. The Hoops Classic was very, very fun. This is the main ball that I want to take home. This is the three-point championship custom. Oh, is that bad? The three-point championship custom ball. This was a Wilson ball, and then they did a custom flame on it with the sneaker con logo right there. I was supposed to check out a while ago, but I'm gonna just chill here for a little bit so I could uh, edit. I did pick up a few sneakers over the past few days. Some were gifted to me, some of them I bought. That huge unboxing that I was gonna do from the purchase that I got off of the GOAT app and I've been hyping it up and I wrote on the box saying do not open until Chicago. I opened it before I left and that's because I didn't have room to take it. And it was pretty much the sub tempos, uh, Supreme up tempos, which is a Supreme right there. I unboxed it and I didn't show the unboxing because like I feel like it would have disappointed a lot of people. These are hyped, sure, but it's a recent release, so I didn't think anybody would really care. So I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna unbox them and just wear them. So I wore these for like the first four minutes of the game, and then I got hit over the head. <laughs> Switched out of them into the Westbrooks, but this was the shoe. Other than that, I got these Ultra Boosts right here for retail. I'm happy I got them. These are the, I don't know what they're called. I'm call, call them the Copper Bottoms. Slippers, the Goyard Custom Slippers. I got these from the homies. So as I'm walking back to the Crep Protect booth, I see this booth of... Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Relax, let me promote. I'm a Goyard guy. Like, I'm slowly getting on the Goyard, and I saw these flip-flops. Now, these are not actual Goyard flip-flops, but this is actual Goyard, like, material. They got it off of bags, right? They take it off of real bags, and then they put them on to, like, Adidas slides, and they got a whole bunch of other ones. Let me show you guys. LV, MCM, Gucci, a whole bunch of other things. Like, man. My man's gonna bless me with one, the Goyard ones, and I said, if y'all wanna get some, you can check out their Instagram and all that stuff. You wanna shout it out? Our Instagram is at Detroit underscore custom underscore slides. You can find us on there. We also got a website link in our bio. Just message us if you wanna do any custom DMs or just place an order on our website and we'll take care of you. We'll talk about future stuff too. Cause I, I wanna do some, maybe some other colorways too, cause colorways. Yeah, maybe like a white bottom would be sick. Yeah, we, we, were, we only did the red cause we made it pop a little bit, yeah. you know, for Chicago. We're talking about going to LA later this summer when okay. you guys go there, so July, yeah. we're gonna come out with a lot more, more higher end like Goyard. We have some more stuff coming there for LA too, cause it's a more higher end market, you know. Oh, for sure, for sure. So I'm gonna link them down below if you guys wanna check them out. Like, it's dope, man. If you like high-end, you're not paying high-end prices, but you're getting high-end brand materials, if you know what that means. But thank you, bro. Appreciate it. Okay, now you guys can scream. Yeah! Adidas slipper with the Goyard material on there. I bought these for $300. I actually have another pair coming, so this is a double up, but it's on a sneaker that's gonna be worn very, very much. So that's why I was, ha I was okay with doubling it up. Calabasas, Adidas. Power phase, powerhouse, power something, I forgot what they're called, but these are the uh, Calabasas Yeezy Adidas. I don't really consider this a Yeezy, but it's the, it's a Kanye sneaker technically, so this is part of the Calabasas collection. And yes, they do look like Reeboks, but it looks like a much better, doper version. It kind of looks like a Gucci shoe in my opinion. It's just a classic silhouette that's re made and look at this leather quality bro this crease is like hell but it's like a nice crease got those for 300 and then i actually got these i'll show you the best for last but i got these for about 200 i actually got one at 350 for him and then i said 300 and he said no and then i was like Come on, bruh. And then I checked the GOAT app and they were only going for like 230 on GOAT app and I was like, bruh, trying to finesse me. And then he let him go for 200. So this, let me show you that box. Obviously that's an Air Jordan 1 box, but it's different. I feel like after I show you guys these, it will remind a lot of people and then you'll see some other sneakerheads go out and get them. The Air Jordan 1 Dave White. It's super cool. I mean, it's not a very wearable version of the Jordan 1, but they just went crazy on it. Basically there's no swoosh. It's like this star splatter with the elephant print right here, suede on the toe, leather, and then the blacked out midsole on the front, kind of like paint splatter to the to the back. This It really looks like this is a custom sneaker, but it's really not. David White for two, three. Might bust these out for like a Jordan event or something. Something like that. That's when, that's the type of occasion you want to save these. If somebody want to act up at a Jordan event, I might have to pull these out, you know what I'm saying? It's a dope box, but I mean, I don't have room for it, so I'm going to... 
just toss those away. So I'm chilling at the at the booth taking pictures and some dude walks up to me and he throws this on the table and he said, this is from Chicago to you. And I was like, what? And he's like, this is from Chicago to you. It's like, you can have these. This is a gift from me and a couple guys. And I'm like, okay. Bam. DMP pack in my size. Can't believe someone freaking gave me this. I had their card. I freaking had their card and I can't find it anymore. So I don't even know who to shout out right now. Shit. I found two business cards here and I don't know which one it was. Okay, it's definitely not this one. Hickory roast chicken barbecue. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Okay, this is, this might be the people that gave me this because I know I get a few business cards per sneaker con, but this is the only one that I can find right now. If it's not them, I apologize. I just gave a shout out to someone else. But if it is, then thank you to them for gifting me these shoes. Very, very good leather quality like insane what the f bruh this this is leather quality that i've never seen before on a jordan this is like balenciaga type material this is like high-end fashion type of material this is like a midnight blue i'm not sure if the camera picks it up but it's not pitch black it's like a midnight blue so yeah those were gifted to me and then i almost forgot about these but these were gifted to me too by a homie who does custom this one right here this is his card you guys want to get some custom work done or something i don't really wear custom sneakers and i told him that but he told me he just wants me to have these. So I was like, okay, I'll take it. Custom made in the all-star colorway from like back in the day when they had it in Arizona. I appreciate the sneakers. Very dope, very dope. All right, now I need to get out of here. I'm gonna edit, check in with you guys very, very soon. Okay guys, so Adam and Slim and the rest of the crew, everybody, they missed their flights this morning. Yeah, because we were like four hours late, I think. <laughs> About four hours. So we actually get on our flight around 6.25, and they're leaving. You guys are leaving tomorrow, yeah? So they're here for another night, but um, their room is actually 5.29 no, if you want to visit them. <laughs> huh? <laughs> okay, my bad. Slim picked up some heat for sneaker con. He got the white Yeezys. And I gotta steal, bro. But you know, they don't stay white for so long, so you gotta break them in, man. Come on. Yo, don't play. Stop, don't play. Guys, don't play. Come on, Stop. Stop, bro, stop. Bro. Let me just, bro, look at mine, is dirty. Yours is dirty. Just step on it. Guys, stop, stop. One time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me draw on them. Up. No, bro. I should draw on it, right? Look, I drew on one. Yo, mess it up, mess it up. It's too, it's too clean, fresh, bro. it's too clean. When you're not looking, I'm gonna sign them, all right? <laughs> the Yeezy Destroyer attacks again. There's four pairs of white Yeezys. Come on. Hey. No, no, no. Let me hold this. YG got the white Yeezys on. Got the white Yeezys. <laughs> okay, wait, wait. Adam has him. Adam has him on too. Come on. Oh, he took it off. He took it off. Should I mess my way? That's how you. Oh, slip, slip, slip. He's kicking you. Nobody else got. All right, we'll let him. We'll let him live for now. Any white shoes? Like, even if I was wearing like. Yeah, no. Brandon, no stop, bro. Like yeah, yeah, finally, that finally looks like your size. Yeah. So the Five, eleven. Yeah, see, he's been wearing a nine. He's been wearing a nine in pirate blacks, and his size is eleven. The people struggle to do for Yeezys. Pirate blacks, they fit me though, honestly. No, they don't fit you. I'm a nine and a half. They're back eleven. Look, this is a good size for you. Oh, stop! Oh, stop! All right, guys, so we just got to the mall. We have about an hour until we need to head back to the hotel to get our bags to go home. We're going to take advantage and kick it with everybody. And I got to say, man, this is probably one of the funnest sneaker cons outside oh, yeah. of the actual convention just because we were all together. And yeah, we, really last yeah. night, we were up till like 1 a.m., 2 a.m. playing this game called, what is it called? Mafia. 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 It's a card game, bro. It was intense. It was super intense, <laughs> but we're at the mall. I say about 15 minutes until security says stop vlogging in here no, no, we'll no. see what happens Brandon is still here and uh, <laughs> thanks for the win guys I got you bro I got you basically this is the schedule right now if the Warriors win game three we have to go to Cleveland for game four because we got to take a fan to the final if we don't take them to the game three uh, to game four and Warriors sweep the Cavs the contest gets you know we can't do that we promised somebody tickets to the finals and we are going to give them so we might be going to Cleveland 
That's gonna be crazy. At the end of this week. But other than that, there's nothing really else on the schedule. We go back to LA. SneakerCon Dallas is in July. And then SneakerCon LA is July 22nd, 23rd. And that will be a Hoops Classic. So we will be balling. And the rosters will be announced very, very soon. But anyway, let's go see what they got. Hopefully, we can find something dope here. Because actually, I'm not really looking for anything. <laughs> Now guys, we're getting kicked out in five minutes. Guaranteed. Guaranteed five minutes we're getting kicked out. Yeah, security kicked us out. It's all good though. We out here. Starbucks, gotta go. Yo guys, so they called the cops on us. What the hell? Anyway, we're headed back to the hotel because we gotta go get our stuff and then we gotta head to the airport and um, then we good to go, man. Can I just say when this goes to trial, I'm not coming back to Chicago because I wasn't in that car. <laughs> exactly. All right guys, so a few of the guys that didn't go in that first Uber with us, they got banned from the mall. The rest of us made it out and now I'm headed to the airport. I'm not sure if we're gonna make our flight, but I think we should be good, hopefully. Let's just say bye to everyone, because it's gonna be a sad moment. I'm All right, guys. No. All right. All right, guys. They didn't care that I was leaving. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's just say you still got us. Fuck. <laughs> so Mickey and um, his boy, they went to the, oh hey, oh, we're leaving today, let's go to downtown Chicago yeah, where the exactly, traffic is yeah. horrible. And now so, make it back in time. Yes. Still that our friends and now we have luggage. to take all their, this is literally all their luggage. So many bags bro. We have to take it for them, Shout you know, swag, but I'm a good friend. <laughs> yeah, what happened to swag? All of a sudden swags disappear. Yeah. Swag, let's just say something's fishy. No goldfish. That's it. Rookie. You make the rookie hold the bag. Wow. Rookie hold the bag. Wow. Thank you, bro. You have a good one, man. One word for Chicago. Wendy. I knew you wouldn't be mad at me because I got you a gift. Yeah. You went to RSVP? No way. Did you really? Yeah. No way. It's a very shark tape. Damn. That's for the house. I talk so much shit about you in the car. <laughs> <laughs> I told him, I was Thank like, you. I'm gonna let him be mad at me the whole way and then give him a gift. I'm using this on the plane, bro. <laughs> Hell yeah. Thank you. <laughs>